Mequa Valley coming off a 9-2 campaign and looking to get a win under its belt against West Aurora, a squad that claimed 25 wins just a year ago in a trip to the state tournament's Elite Eight. And early on, it looks like the Blackhawks will be the same contender they were last season, mainly because of that guy, Marquise Walker. The senior guard following up his triple with a dive to the basket, count the bucket and one. West Aurora up 21 to 12. And Walker isn't done. Here's another three of his game high 27 points in helping the Blackhawks extend the lead to 26 to 12. But the Wildcats trying to trip away. Mark Gronowski swings the ball down low to a cutting Connor Davis and the sophomore kisses it off the glass. 34-21 Blackhawks going into the half. Third quarter now and senior Centuali Nalls taking the rock coast to coast. Finishes with the floater. NV now down 40 to 29. A few moments later, Nalls again running the floor, but this time finds a wide open Patrick Hoffman who buries the three ball. Deficit cut to single digits. Less than two to go in the fourth quarter, Wildcats finding sophomore John Polakaitis who knocks in the three. But Nikwa runs out of time, falling to West Aurora 65 to 56. It was first game jitters. I mean, everybody struggled. Uh, both teams struggled. But as far as going through the season, I mean, I feel like I'm the best guard on the quarter all the time. The first half was pretty much on me. I uh, turned the ball over a couple times. So that's what disrupted the offense. And in the first half, and then once I settled down, got the teammates involved, then everything worked out for me. But we're going to be fine as the season goes on.